Welcome to Billingham Stars TV, your home for highlights of the Ultimate Windows Billingham Stars. The only game of the weekend for your stars tonight here at the Forum. And it's second versus first as the league leading Solway Sharks come into town with one hand already on the league trophy. Will they have it confirmed by the end of tonight's play? Well, here's all of the action with NIHL radio commentary with Anthony Lowe and Jonathan Langstaff. Of Coulter. And now Michael Elder finds Dennis Bostrom on his off wing. Bostrom comes in, takes the shot, and it's off the post. Dennis Bostrom rattling the pipes early. I don't think Hutchinson will be giving him that much space anymore. No, he gave and him he far too much separation. Him. It does just manage to come out now, and Stephen Moore collects. Moore plays it across, and he is Stuart and Tonner. Oh, and that's hurt Andy Finn. He is down in a heap on the ice, Andy Finn, and he can't get off. Yeah, and that's you heard him as well. Stars as Boeza chased that down, sends it out in front and it's a goal. Terry Ward not happy, he felt that there should have been a yeah, whistle Yeah, the referee the should have went with the player down. I can't, I can't think that's a rule now, is it? When there's an injured player down, the referee's got to blow his whistle? Well, I think it's when the uh, when the team touches, when the team that has a man down has possession of the puck, and the Stars did have possession of the puck for a time there. Here's Chris Sykes, comes into the zone, stick handles, still manages to get it on net. Oh, that's an early, early whistle from Mr. Farron. He's blown all that Farron so does is put his early. Arms up. All he does is put his arms up to say sorry. Yeah, puts his arms up to say sorry, but... He knew what he was doing. That there wasn't covered for a second. It wasn't covered at all. There was no point that his glove went over that puck and Mr. Farron's blown. Yeah, now he stood next to Mr. Hepburn saying, I did you a favour there, didn't I, mate? Now he stood next to Mr. Hepburn saying, please, sir, don't eat me. Face you know off what? won by the Stars. You don't mind officials making mistakes all night long, as long as it was consistent with what Oh, and here's Jack Watkins, one-on-one -on -one with Callum Hepburn. Watkins deeks the backhand. He's put it wide. He's missed the net. That's the third time that Stars have had one-on-ones with Hepburn. Callum Hepburn. And but this time, it. Hepburn was beaten. Yeah. He was beaten. He's been beaten twice now on the tie, and the net's been missed. Face off to Flavel's right. He's won by no one initially, and then Dan Palmbjork comes in and takes possession. Puck given away though by the Stars, Spears takes the shot on the backhand and then the rebound is touched in at the back stick. Couldn't quite see who it was, it looks like Mark Fowley who potted that puck on the rebound. It's been coming, the Stars have been so slow and so sloppy at the start of this period. Yeah, I would agree. So it's 2-0. Shot comes in and wide by the Sharks. A shot again from the point, this time I think it was Kerr and slapped the length of the ice and that what on earth has been given here? Andy Finn's got a penalty, or is it a bench penalty? What for? What on earth happened here? Ben he's, Davison is absolutely living. He's, let he's all given a slash. Go. He's let all sorts go. He's let the game go. He's let big slashes go. He's let big hooks go. Trips go. He's let he's let naughty stuff go, and then he calls that. Hutchinson taking his time, building a little bit of momentum now. Tries to dump it in, gets very lucky. As Moore comes in and there's an offside washed out by the officials. Shot comes in and it's a goal. And the Stars are going to be absolutely furious here. Because that looked offside to me. And then Finn has a broken Andy stick Finn in the corner. is absolutely furious as it's 3-0 to the Someone's Sharks. Someone's going to get a 10 minute off this guy in a minute. Scott Ward is bouncing over there. Here we go. Terry Ward is bouncing. Here comes a 10 minute for Scott Ward here, you know. I think the other thing Andy Finn's saying is... Where's the slash? Where's the slashing call? You broke my stick. Where's the slashing call? As the Stars come back to four men. And here is Michael Bowman. Bowman's, oh, Bowman's lost, lost the blade. blade. And it's a goal. Washed out. It's been washed out. Andy Finn had his arms in the air straight away. Was it kicked in? I have no idea whatsoever. He's pointing straight at the face-off circle. Yeah, so no goal on the play. And, and there's the no question away. asked whatsoever from a Solway player. But now, because of that, a chance for Dennis Bostrom to motor down the far. He's being hooked and it still gets the shot off. And the Stars screaming for the hooking penalty. Nothing given. And there's a trip. The Stars bench are furious, and rightly so. Dennis Bostrom has been hooked and tripped on that play. Chris Sykes has been hooked and slashed. But he's still got the puck. Chris Sykes comes in front, gets it to go! Chris Sykes. The streak continues for Sykes. Bostrom was naughty there, by the way. I didn't notice that. I that puck was in, and he just comes flying in with his stick. I know his it stick like was... He's hurt. Yeah, he Hepburn. went straight through um, his Hepburn. 
I'm just watching there. We've got it on close up on the monitor. And Mr. Farron has just said the words after the puck went in the net. It was a bit of a hospital pass, but Ben Davison wins it back and dumps it around the boards. Michael Elder and Andrew takes a run at Elder. And Michael Elder has just slashed the stick and out of his hand. I don't, I don't really blame the punch, to be honest, because Michael Elder wasn't happy at the hit, so took a massive swing. Oh, dear me! Michael Elder's down. Dennis Bostrom is furious. Oh, he comes Sykes off the bench. Sykes is furious. There's a deliberate shot. It, he's going to be out the game. That's a Michael spear Elder. or something of the sort. And there. I'll tell you what, Mr. Emerson's seen that. Either Emerson or Smith has seen that. Sykes will get a penalty for coming at the off the stars. bench. Players straight off the what bench. What a cheap, cheap hockey player Andrews is. That he's was disgusting. disgusting by Andrews. He is disgusting. He should be out of the game for this. He's going to go and sit in the box. He Luke should Brown's be off the, the bench as Luke well. Luke Brown is furious. Luke Brown wants anyone that'll take him. Dave Farrell, he's got it. That is shocking. I'd love, I'd, it'd be interesting to see if that's even on the highlights. It might be, it might be caught from the GoPro footage behind the net at that end, at the cafe end. We can't be letting this, this is why we're bullied. He's out the game. He is out of the game. Luke Brown still chasing Luke him. Luke Brown wants him. Luke Brown will be out the game Do you here. Know what, can you blame him though? No, though? I can't. 100% don't blame him. Uh, honestly, that was such a cheap, cheap play by Andrews. There's ways and means to do things in hockey. If you don't like a hit on you, do it back to them. Exactly. Luke Brown's in the box and Luke Brown is trying to get... Do you know what? You know what, Luke Brown? I've just noticed who's actually having a go at Luke Brown. It's the sole way kit man. Here's Kerr now, up against the boards, collected by the Stars. It's James Moss, back to the point, fired the pass, and defended well with it. Here's Moss, played all the way across for Sykes. Oh, Netminder had no idea where that puck yeah, was, he's, and Sykes he's, throws it back in front. He's kind of like flicked his back leg out, and he's kind of got it away from the goal somehow. Looks like, like it. There's Whee! a huge one, <laughs> and finally the Stars get one their way. He did not dare. I think Terry. <laughs> got to say. I think Terry might have left the bench and <laughs> went. <laughs> Pambio, back to Watkins for Thornton. Now go across ice. Thornton sends it behind the net, collected by Pambio. Sykes now back to Pambio. Takes the shot. It's a goal. Damn Pambio! Perfect. It's the top corner. Patience. You had two minutes to set up the perfect play. Yeah. And, and the, they were just finding what would work better for them. It turned out to be the better player was someone down low behind the net. It was so perfect. It was just they just they just set they, it up. They had two set minutes it up to set it up. Set it up. It wasn't like it was a five on four where you're going to get hassled. It was and a five on three. It's a one goal game. Sykes can't keep possession of it. Statsfield tries to send it goalwards. Collected. Oh, and that's a poor, poor pass by. Jack Watkins, Mark Fowley collects the puck but then gives it away to James Moss. Watkins, Moss can't right. get it out of the... Whoop. And here's a chance for Spears. Good save by James Flavel. Out in front, it's a goal. And Jack Watkins knows it himself. He slaps himself on He's the pad. He's out of game and that's probably the game done now. Yeah, 4 Bostrom, two Bostrom got the 10 minute as well, not Luke Brown. Yeah, I've discovered that one in the intermission. It was Dennis Bostrom that got the 10 minute misconduct penalty. So he'll be sat for... A fair while, so maybe he'll come out all guns blazing. Here's Richie Thornton. Dan Palmbiok's had a few lean weeks, really. He's scored tonight, but his overall performance has dipped a little bit in the last few weeks. Here's Spears now. Fires the Look, shot. He's got hold of him. And they're still out in front. He's still got hold what of him. What on earth is going on here? Statusfield just shoved a glove in his face. Statusfield has Richie Thornton's just grabbed hold of him. Statusfield dropped his gloves. Dan Palmbiok's gloves have not come He just off. had tight hold of Palmbiok and wouldn't let go of him. So Richie has grabbed hold of Statusfield. And then Spears, is it, who's trying to look after Statusfield? I don't know why anyone's trying to look after Statusfield. It was him that started it. That's crazy. He just wouldn't let go of Palmbiok, trying to initiate something. Well, it'll be interesting to see what comes of this. It's a strange You know exactly what's going to happen. Richie and Dan will both go in the box. Statusfield will go in the box for the sole way, and they'll get the best end of it. And Richie Thornton's out the game. Huh? For letting his mate get... Oh, third man in. Richie, third man Thor in. 
Richie Thornton's out of the game for third man in. Yep. So it'll be interesting to see some of that footage potentially. Oh, dear oh. me. And Andy Finn has just hip checked his own man. Look at him laughing his head off. But he's, la he's just stood and laughed his head I'm sorry, that is terrible from Andy Finn. He just stood and laughed his head off after hip checking his own man rather than get him trying to get back into position. Andy Finn at no stage is having to get back into position there and there's a goal come from it. That's poor from Andy Finn in my opinion. Now I have a lot of... He's had a poor game all round to be honest as well. That, that was, yeah, that was poor from Andy Finn. After an eventful game then at the Forum, Solway Sharks take the win five goals to two and with it confirming the NIHL North Division 1 title. First league title in three years for Martin Grubbs men and adds to the Northern Cup they won earlier in the season. Billingham Stars are confirmed as playoff candidates, so the two seeds may meet again in the playoffs. That's further down the road. Tonight though, man of the match for the Solway Sharks went to Connor Henderson and for the Billingham Stars was Daniel Palmbjerk. You can check out the Billingham Stars TV YouTube channel post-game interviews with Stars General Manager Alan Flavel, Solway Sharks head coach Martin Grubb and our Handles Bank and Man of the Match winners, Connor Henderson and Daniel Pomerbjorg. That's all on our YouTube channel. We'll see you next week for the visit of the Dragons from D-Side. But for now, thanks for watching. This is Billingham Stars TV, your home for highlights of the ultimate windows. Billingham Stars.